Earlier this summer, members of UNI's College of Education gathered on campus with fellow classmates from 1955. For some, it was the first trip back to UNI in a long time. But for all of them, it was a great opportunity to reconnect with their fellow classmates who went on to have tenured careers as physical education teachers, coaches, and even administrators. Eric Braley fills us in on what it feels like to come back to the college you once called home nearly 60 years ago. The city of Cedar Falls and the University of Northern Iowa have experienced significant change the past 60 years. A special group of teaching physical education alumni were on campus this summer to look at the school that helped mold them into the people they are today. I think UNI is probably still one of the premier teacher education institutions in the country. I know it's the best in Iowa, and I think it's one of the best in the country. When we came back and we saw the facilities that they have now, we said, oh, why? Why couldn't we come back and start over again? Because it's so much nicer and so much better, you know? But we enjoy that other people now have that facility to use. It has changed so much since our time. Grown and all the new buildings and the new technology. The connotation that Iowa State Teachers College had back then plus what it is now. It's just fantastic to be a part of this. This group has made a positive impact on students and athletes across the country as they devoted many years to the teaching and coaching profession. I retired from Mankato State. I was up there for 29 or third years. Started the women's swimming team. Didn't have any coaching background. Coached the women's golf for a number of years and was department chair plus doing teaching. And I taught at Mesa and I coached and I was assistant athletic director and I taught tennis, had a coaching team tennis, and uh, running, cross country running, and I just enjoy the whole experience. It's a wonderful city and it's a wonderful place and wonderful people there too, and just as friendly as the people in Iowa that I've met and enjoyed, and uh, I loved every bit of it. To feel then that I accomplished quite a bit in helping them grow, and I know that as a fact because students would come back and say thank you. And so that helped me and that helped them. These alums have made the University and College of Education extremely proud with their accomplishments in the field of physical education and athletics. And this group of ladies brought out the very best in each other. The uh, personality of this group is just is something else. They, you very seldom see anybody that's sad uh, that will not help somebody else if they need it. We were not a big group, and we did had so many classes together and did so many things together that we, as you can tell, have become a pretty close-knit group. And we've all enjoyed getting together at different places and gotten a little travel in, you know, to where other people live. And uh, so we've gotten to see the country as a whole. Uh, their life values and lifestyles, healthy, but not just in physical healthy, but I think in um, Finding fulfillment in life, they do things that are enthusiastic and helpful to other people. We probably wouldn't have made it if we hadn't been together. We supported each other and well, we just had everything together all the time. Well, we had a great time, whatever we were doing. Sometimes we got together and laughed and sometimes we got together and cried. And sometimes we just had to help each other out. If uh, somebody had a problem, we tried to solve it, and, uh, but we had lots and lots of good times. 